Good morning guys, it's Emily Elizabeth and today I'm taking you along with me on a motorcycle ride. I don't talk about my motorcycle that much, but today I thought I would take you along on um, a ride that's called Neil's Ride. It's up in New Hampshire and starts in Seacoast, like the Hampton Beach area if you're not familiar with it. But we are going to take a ride that supports breast cancer and veterans. So all the money that we are raffling and people have donated today will go to those foundations. But it will just be hundreds and hundreds of motorcycles, sports bikes and Harleys all riding together to just come and raise money and awareness for these two foundations. So I'm super, super excited. This So much work has gone into it, including the work my mom has done. So I cannot thank everybody enough for everything they have done to put into this day. And luckily it is a beautiful day outside so I'm so, so excited that it the weather worked out for us because I did this ride last year and the weather was like good for the most of the day and then rainy at the end. But anyways, the weather's good today so it should be a good turnout. I am going to get all geared up and head over there. But let's get this day started. Okay guys, I made it here. I'm kind of squinting because I can't find my sunglasses right now. I'm decked out in my red, white, and blue for the veterans. And then I have my pink jacket to support the breast cancer side. But look how many bikes are here. This isn't even the start of it, guys. Like, not even everybody is here yet. Everybody's still checking in. We got a raffle going on over there. So, and it's such a beautiful day. So we're gonna get this day started. I'm gonna go check in myself and find wherever my mom is. <laughs> This is Jim, he's got his drone today. I'm so excited for that footage. Here's where the magic's gonna happen. <laughs> I love it, it's a beautiful drone. Wave to YouTube. Here we go. Okay, so the ride is starting at Seacoast Harley in Hampton, or Seabrook technically. We have the raffle about to start. I'm so excited for that drone footage for you guys. All right, let's go check in. Okay, so this is actually, it is! Wait, hold on, I gotta zoom in on you. There you are. This guy helped me learn how to ride. This is the Harley that I learned to ride and I bought my bike in. So you ready to ride? I'm working, we gotta ride. Yeah? I'm vlogging all day. She's already here, she's been here since 7.30. <laughs> or whatever time. Okay, this is my friend Eva. She's who I stayed at her house last night, so I'm very thankful for that. And Glenn, and her friend Mike, Mike. We're all gonna ride up together to the settlement.
That was a beautiful ride. We're at Saddle Up Saloon. Holy moly, it is hot though, but it's a good day to ride still. So I'm glad that it worked out. That was such an incredible ride. It was just beautiful, like the windy roads and everything. A couple parts where cars kept trying to cut us off and stuff, which is kind of annoying. So if you ever see a huge line of bikes, we're usually riding for a foundation or some cause, anything like that. So just let us be. Like my mom went to Americade in New York uh, a couple weeks ago. Where they stayed was just so happy to have them because they're always like, motorcyclists are the best, most humble, welcoming, respectful people we ever have. Like they're not trashing the place. Like I said, they're super respectful. So we really, they have a bad stigma, but anyways, I'm so glad that I was able to be part of this ride and raise money. So inside we're gonna do a 50-50 raffle. So all the money we raise gets donated to the Dan Neely Foundation for Vets and the Breast Cancer Awareness One. I don't know if you can hear me over all these bikes, but. I'm just so glad, this is so awesome. I'll have to find out for you guys too how many bikes came today. Last year on this ride, we there was like 500 bikes and then there wasn't as many even because there was supposed to be rain in the forecast, but today is completely nice. So I'm sure there's like a couple extra hundred bikes today. So I'm gonna go inside, get a drink and hang out. I hope you guys enjoyed the footage though of all of the bikes. I'm just so excited that I was able to get that because I had that chest cup this time. So I hope it came out good for you guys. Harley to get service, just a regular like oil change and whatnot, based on the mileage. So if you guys are not familiar with the area, there was a very, very bad accident on the highway the other day where a pickup truck hit seven motorcyclists and all of them died. There was people that jumped out of their cars, tried to do CPR, tried to save them, everything, and, it, and they were just gone. Nobody really knows what happened exactly, but all the money that we just raised today from the 50-50 raffle was donated back to the Jarheads um, who they were a part of that group. 
So, I mean, I'm glad we could donate, but it's just, it's such a sad case because one small little thing can go sideways so fast and all seven of them passed away. So just, it's just an, another reminder just to be wary of motorcyclists. We're not crazy, like it's just we're trying to have a ride and have a good time. So just watch out for them and keep your distance because you need space. We're gonna head out, we had a great time. We're gonna ride back, drop our bikes off and then ride back to Massachusetts. So I hope you guys have all been enjoying this and let's hit the road. All right, here's my beauty, my XG750, ready to ride. Some people are like, oh, this is such a small bike. Well, I'm a small person. I had to modify my, the seat and modify the handlebars, but hey, I'm riding. So we're back at Seacoast and dropping my bike off to get serviced. But this was where it all started. I learned how to ride right in that parking lot right there. And this is where I bought my bike. It's gonna get serviced, then we'll head back to Massachusetts. There's my beautiful mama. She has a soft tail slim.